what is up my fellow gamers in today's video we are finally using our star studded pool tickets that we've been saving up we got a hundred and thirty six tickets hopefully we can get some amazing legendary players specifically top tier ones that i can go ahead and sell for lots of gold so i can buy some other players that i want additionally additionally for the events we found out that Kawhi Leonard will be in the Game Changer pool tomorrow. Game Changer tickets is another one I've been hoarding. I have like almost 180 Game Changer tickets. So this is the one we are going hard in. We are gonna try and pull as many Kawhi Leonards tomorrow as we can. So this is another one, uh, definitely sought after player that I personally want. He's pretty much like the legendary version of Paul George in this game. So anyone, anytime we can have a really strong defensive player, that's what I'm looking for. So I'm going to be super excited for that video. And also yesterday we got our NBA Infinite Courtside Creator merch. We got the hoodie. We got some sweatpants, which you can't see the sweatpants. And we also got ourselves a hat as well. <laughs> now I'm not selecting anything for our wish list. If you take a look at the bottom, I'm kind of blocking it, but you are guaranteed your wish listed legendary player by your 30th draw. Embiid, Tatum, and, and Lillard, these are all pretty cheap players. They're all roughly like a million, uh, 1.5 million. I really don't particularly want any of these, although I am building out Embiid. We maxed out Paul George already, so Embiid is going to be our next player that we're trying to max out. However, it's going to be more beneficial to go ahead and summon a player that costs a lot more so that way we can flip them on the market get like five six million and then go ahead and buy like four or five copies of Embiid instead of just pulling one Embiid so I'm leaving my wish list blank so hopefully we can get you know maybe we'll get something like Curry James Durant Anthony Davis James Harden so we'll see what we can do 136 tickets we're gonna do this 10 draws, but I'm gonna let the animations play out to make it more exciting. So here we go, our first 10 draw. This, I'm gonna have a lot of players to list on the market after this. And then tomorrow we're gonna do another like 160 or something. I have a lot of tickets I've been saving up. I was specifically hoping that they would release like a whole batch of new players at once. But it seems like that's not going to be the case. We're only going to be getting players possibly one at a time, it seems. So I'm just going to go ahead and we're just going to start doing our summons now. We got a Donovan Mitchell, which he's okay. Doesn't really go for too much in the market. Uh, yeah, but we'll see if we can get a, a, little bit of, a little bit of gold for him, right? Um, the Curries, the rookie Curries, and the rookie LeBron James, and look, rookie uh, KD, those are always good to sell. I typically sell those at max price, and they, they pretty much always sell. Like right there, that's a good one. We're just looking for things that, that we can really flip on the market, make a lot of gold, and then buy as many Embiid's as we can. I think I have Embiid at, oh, that is a good one. Wow, that is a good one. We got a Carl Anthony Towns. He's going for like 700K right now on the market. That is a huge hit. We can basically flip flop a Towns for practically Im Embiid because Embiid's going for like 980 right now. He's going for a little less than a million. So that was a great pull right there. We're at 118 tickets still. We have not pulled our legendary yet. I think we're going to get a legendary in this one, our guaranteed legendary. Come on, somebody good. Somebody worth a lot. Somebody worth like 5 million. Come on. Oh man, this is Jason Tatum. Yeah. Maybe we'll keep him, but he's he's not going for as much as I want him to. I was hoping he would go for like at least two million, but he's only like hovering around that 1.3, 1.4 million mark, which I'm surprised because he, he got a huge buff and he's really good in the game now. I mean, like really strong. Hey, we got a, a Lari Markinen as well. Tons and tons still to do. This is gonna be a bit of a long video. So go ahead, grab your drinks, grab your snacks. We got a lot of tickets to go through. Hopefully we can get one of those big legendaries, uh, like a five, six, seven million legendary. If we can get Embiid to a rank 
five. That would be amazing. Uh, Bam out of Bayou. That's a good one. That's actually a good one. I'm actually saving him. I'm not selling him. So that's another one that we're kind of trying to build out like slowly over time. Because I think he's like one of the top tier centers in this game. But yeah, I, I, what do I have? I think I have a tier four Embiid or a tier three. No, tier four, I think. I, I can't even remember. We got a Siakam. Siakam's another one that I'm also building out. We got two epics out of this 10 pull, which is pretty good. Two really strong epics too. So uh, our... Legendary should be our next 10 pull. We got Kyle Lowry as well. We got two 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 good epics right there. Go on, somebody big. Give me It's a it's a joker. I would kind of want to use him, but I will definitely sell him. Uh, he's not going for as much as Zambonis. Zambonis is a pretty fun player in this game. Joker, we could get a little bit for him. He's going for what? Roughly like 2 million, less than, way less than 3 million. I forget what his price is. So, uh, so far, two legendaries, and they haven't been like the greatest. So far, I think we'd get like what? Like 4 or 5 million gold we're looking at if we sell a lot of the players we've gotten so far. We still got 82 tickets. So, we're still looking at what? At least two more legendaries right we should we should still get two more legendaries we got like two more chances unless we get super duper randomly lucky and we pull a legendary off of the pity hey we got zion zion is a good one i'm actually building him out too so that's one that i probably will definitely keep we should have enough to max out tobias harris as well i'm gonna try and do an all sixers team for dynasty mode maxed out which would be pretty cool i know we're missing some players there's not like a full five man player for the sixers in here but we'll have to use like a mantras harrell even though he was like a former sixer <laughs> just because he has like this he's wearing the sixer jersey in the in his portrait in the game but we definitely need maxi we definitely need a tyrese maxi in the game and we definitely need a Kelly Oubre in the game as well. We could get those two players. Here we go. We got Damian Lillard. Oh, God. He's not going for a lot either. He's going for roughly like 1 million. So that's not a that's not a good legendary to pull. <sighs> I was hoping for one of the better ones. But yeah, that's another one. That's, that's basically a one for one trade. We could trade Damian Lillard for an Embiid. So, yeah. I think I need uh, to get to the next rank for Embiid. I think I need eight copies. This doesn't seem like a lot, but it actually is a lot when you you look at it from like a legendary standpoint. And he's like the cheapest legendary too. I mean, eight copies of him. That's eight million gold. I can't imagine you know the people who are trying to max out these other legendaries that cost like three or four, five, six million gold, right? Like some of those legendaries, they're insanely expensive. I can't imagine just like that would take me. I feel like that would take me like a year, years, right? To try and max out one of those like players that cost five, six million. Pretty ridiculous. We got another Towns. That's a great pull. That's a great sell. Sell him. And that, that's a basically an instant flip for an Embiid. We got another Curry. We've got... I roughly, I want to say, after we're done, we might have around 10 million gold. Through all the stuff we can sell, it's going to be close. We still got 46 more. We could have a huge hit. We get a huge, huge legendary hit. I mean, we're going to be set. This is a long video. We're looking at, what, 10 minutes already? <laughs> Definitely uh, longer than, than typical. I usually try and keep the videos... Oh, we got a Halliburton. I haven't seen... I have not seen Halliburton in a long time. Like I, I have never like pulled one. Here we go, legendary. We can get like three million from him. That's pretty good, right? But still, I'm, I'm being kind of greedy in this video. I'm, I'm looking for those, those six millions, those, those seven millions. You know, I want to pull a James Harden and sell him or something. You know, I want one of those crazy ones. But yeah, you know, Giannis is like, we get three million. So I think we're gonna have roughly at least 10 million by the end of this video through selling all the things we're going to sell easy 10 million we should definitely be able to buy eight copies of Embiid 
We got a Brook Lopez, uh, Tobias. We're gonna have a maxed out Tobias. Ooh, there's a Drew Holiday. We're gonna have a maxed out Tobias Harris. We're gonna have, who else are we gonna have maxed out? We got a uh, maxed out Kyle Lowry. <laughs> We're gonna need, look, there he is again. I mean, he's pop, he pops up every single time. I'm looking for one big hit, just one big legendary hit and then I'll feel accomplished. Can we get one big legendary hit? The other thing is I can, you know, I could sell or I might recycle some of these to get more star studded. We have to see how many tickets I need left. Like how many tickets I have left for these pulls. We got 19 left. So, all right, so we're gonna have one left over. We're gonna be able to do one more 10 pull, so that's not bad. Fred Van Vliet, uh, Jordan Poole. Oh, gosh. Oh, man. My eye's a bit itchy. Oh, we got a legendary. Ah. <sighs> I mean, it's, we could have got somebody who, you know, we could have sold for more. We got an Embiid. It's like, it's a bittersweet moment to pull him. It's a bittersweet moment. We, we need him, but we want to get better legendaries to flip them and then buy him for cheaper on the market. But. All right, we got an Embiid, but we didn't get any like big ones, like the highest, most expensive Legendary we got was what? Giannis, right? Oh, we got a new subscriber. Welcome, welcome. I can't say that name. Van, Van QHS, welcome to the club. Thanks for subscribing. Live while we're doing this, while I'm recording this video, we're getting new subscribers. This is pretty cool. All right. I don't think we're going to get another legendary. Rudy! think that was our last one but I think we did pretty decent we did we did pretty decent for what we got right we got a we got a lot of stuff we got one ticket left over but yeah our wish list we didn't do a wish list and we didn't get any huge hits unfortunately so, oh yeah we have them at a four okay so yeah we need six more copies we can easily buy six more copies from the stuff we're gonna be able to sell, you know, like I said, we got probably at least 10 million more than 10 million gold. So we'll have a rank five in bead and we'll be pushing to get him to rank six very soon. So that's not bad. And then we have our um, maxed out Paul George as well. Tomorrow is gonna to be even more fun. We're gonna be going for Kawhi Leonard and we have uh, 159 game changer tickets saved up. 90 is gonna get us that guaranteed Kawhi. I'm trying to hopefully get 180, but I don't, I think I bought all the tickets, so I'm not going to have enough. So we're going to be, you know, 159. We're going to be close to getting two copies guaranteed of Kawhi, but it is going to be an increased rate. So maybe we'll just get randomly lucky and we'll, you know, have an increased rate and pull him. But that is it. I hope you guys and girls enjoyed the video. Stay happy, stay safe. I'll see y'all later. Peace. Uh